The 2012-13 season was one of the snowiest on record in the states of New England. Case Snow persevered through some 32-inch to 42-inch blizzards. Case Snow's employees were trained properly and they put everything they had into uh, the hours that they spent into maintaining the equipment in, in order to keep going. And we were successful at the end of the year. I'm really proud of the team. The first blizzard in February uh, really hit us hard. It was a hurricane, it was a few storms that collided. Uh, they even named it Nemo uh, because it was a, a hurricane stature storm. It dumped anywhere from 42 inches to 25 inches across the territories that we service. We had lost power on the East Bay. All of Route 136 basically from Seekonk to Newport had lost power. And in the middle of the height of the storm where it's coming down two to three inches an hour, you can barely see over the end of your truck and with 50, 60 mile an hour winds blowing the snow over your blade back against you, you really can't see. So the challenge was, was pretty fun, especially when we got through the storm, saw the sunset come up the next day, and man was it beautiful. It was really a lot of fun once we got on the, uh, the good side of things. Uh, in the event like Nemo, where we have a conga line of trucks and bobcats that work continuously to remove the snow immediately after the storm, uh, 30 hours straight of just a conga line of trucks and, um, and, and people in and out of the vehicles to keep it going non-stop, constantly. It was the biggest snowstorm in probably three or four years that we've seen. The smaller storms that followed Nemo it seemed to be pretty simple after we had cleared feet of snow going to plow three or four inches seemed to be pretty uh, easy going for our crews. The reason we're so well prepared is, is the training that they use. I think the big event prepared them for those smaller events. It made it a lot easier on them, less stressful. It was a tough storm. Hadn't seen one like that in a long time so um, you know we got got through it the best we could and you know after the fact getting everything coordinated and getting every all the sites reopened in time for that Monday commute um, Definitely, you know, having the resources behind us made that possible. So we are going to take a lot of what we've learned and implement it in the off season and to make us better as a company and individuals as a service company in the field for the following season.